this one. Uh, well, it's um, obviously it's a very sad day. It's um, someone like that who's been admired and respected uh, leaves us uh, earlier than he should have. It's uh, you know it's sad, and uh, I know he, the effect that he had on on basketball around the world. He'll, he'll be mourned around the world tonight. Over the course of the years, uh, did you have much interaction with him? Not really. I didn't know him well. Uh, didn't know him at all. Uh, I just knew him as a competitor. Um, you know, I remember him coming in as a rookie in the summer league in Long Beach. Um, but obviously, uh, just like everybody else, uh, I, I admired and respected what he did uh, for the NBA and what he did with his career. How would you describe him as a competitor? Like, competing against him? Uh, you just knew that every night he was... Uh, you were in a battle every night. Every time you played against him, you, you knew you were going to get uh, his best effort. That's just uh, that's the way he played the game. Do you think it's difficult to make the players, the players to kind of get focused in a game like this after this kind of thing? I do. I do. I think it's. Uh, I think every player uh, will be affected by it one way or the other. Uh, everybody will deal with it in their own way. But uh, you know, Kobe, whether he was a uh, uh, a peer or a contemporary, like he was with Trevor and uh, Carmelo, or if he's uh, an idol or an icon to some of our younger players, uh, his impact will be felt by everybody.